Hey everybody, it's Chris. I'm here to discuss whether or not uh, traditional websites are a dying breed. Um, there's been a lot of discussion about how design has been changing for mobile applications and whether or not this is affecting uh, traditional website design. Um, we know that mobile usage is on the rise. Um, a lot more people have access to mobile devices now. Um, subscribers worldwide, uh, the numbers have been increasing since 2009. Uh, as you can see here, uh, at the end of 2011, there were 6 billion mobile subscriptions, estimates the International Telecommunications Union. Uh, that's equivalent of 87% of the world population. And this is a big increase uh, from 2010. As you can see there. Um, along with mobile subscribers comes uh, internet access through their mobile devices. Um, also on the, on the rise recently. Uh, global use of mobile devices to access the internet has been increasing since January 2009 where it stood at 0.7% and just in January of this year uh, up to 8.5 percent so a lot more people are getting their internet access from their mobile devices even their first time use uh, for for internet is coming from uh, their mobiles um, as you can see here more people are getting the internet through the use of mobile devices or tablets um, there's another quote um, by 2015, more U.S. Internet users will access the Internet through mobile devices than through PCs or other wireline devices. Uh, as smartphones begin to outsell simple feature phones and as media tablet sales explode, the number of mobile Internet users will grow by a compound annual growth rate of 16.6% between now, uh, 2010 and 2015. Um, so all the predictions are showing that um, usage uh, for the internet on mobile devices will increase by 2015. Um, it's definitely not decreasing. And so what does this mean for traditional web design? How will it affect how websites are being built? Um, as we know uh, traditional web design is a little bit different than the mobile applications uh, that we're seeing coming out now. Um, new mobile design takes away a lot of the junk that you'll see in traditional website design. Unnecessary tabs and menu features. Um, basically, uh, mobile applications designed for mobile can simplify the complexity that a traditional website will uh, offer. Simplifies things, makes it a little more humanistic. Um, and with touch, touch screen technology, uh, the interaction with um, mobile devices becomes a little more humanistic. Uh, also, um, the simplicity that comes with uh, designing for mobile apps. Um, mobile users can interact uh, sim more simply with uh, the interface for mobile devices. Um, makes it easier to use and when you're out and about and there's a lot of distractions. Um, the application needs to be quick and easy and um, users don't really want to navigate too much through the site, they just want to get to where they want to go uh, and find things easily. So overall, um, I believe traditional websites are a dying breed. Um, most of it's due to the increase of mobile usage. Um, more people are using mobile devices versus desktop computers and they're getting their first in internet interactions that way. Um, and this interaction from mobile devices becoming more humanistic with touch screen technology and just the ease and accessibility of having a mobile device with internet access um, creates a world where people on the go want a more simple and direct 
way of uh, interacting with the internet and the world around them. Thank you. That's it. Four degrees in Hartford and Enfield this afternoon, upper 80s along the shore, and another stuffy night tonight with temperatures down into the upper.